cool fish. I thought I had a piranha. We are in these boats made out of a tree trunk, though. Look at how tiny. Oh. <laughs> yeah! What is going on, crows? Welcome back to another video. We're here at the farm, which is probably weird because we've been in the Amazon jungle the last couple of days. Well, we're still going there. Today is the last day in the Amazon jungle. Here you go, babe. You guys too. <laughs> now today's video is a little bit special. We do a lot, and when I mean a lot, from fishing to visiting a village full of kids, exploring the jungle, and of course you read by the title and thumbnail, we're probably gonna end up making a purchase by the end of this video as well. This is one to watch, and it's the last episode, like I said. So after this episode, we'll be back to the normal, back to the farm, back to the screaming animals and the fish tanks and ponds. Once this entire video is over, I'll meet you right back here at the farm. Let the adventure begin after today's video sponsor. Today's video is sponsored by Factor. If you guys have never seen Factor before, you're about to find out what Factor is all about. Now, I love this company. They are fresh, never frozen meals, chef prepared, dietitian approved, no prep, no mess, heat and eat in two minutes. Factor is about that life. Oh, yeah. Now, that was literally two minutes, heat it up in the microwave, peel it off and you have a nice meal ready to go for you. I'm not exactly sure how Factor packed up a meal that good for that cheap. Now for me, I'm always on the go. So Factor is huge. And Factor is this easy. Grab it out the fridge, your meal's right there, ready to get heated up. Now head over to factor75.com and use my code paulcafero 50 for 50% 50 off your first box. 50% off, it's practically free. They're grab and go, they arrive right to your doorstep. Factor is something you want in your fridge and getting delivered to you constantly. Thank you so much Factor for sponsoring today's video. That is again paulcafero 50 for 50% 50 off your first meal. Cheers to that. Back to the video. made it out into the river. Today's mission, catch a monster catfish. Red tail, tiger shovel nose, whatever it may be. We've got them all at home in our pond. We're about to try to catch one. Yes, yes, thank you. Oh my good, look at all that. Oh! Our rig is very simple. Leader, hook, lots of earthworm, a little two ounce weight. And this is the setup I'm using. My line is just dumping and it's moving. Dang piranha, oh my gosh. Yeah, they're going ham on that thing right now. Uh, oh, 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 it's almost ripped the rod out of my hand. Oh. Did you see that? Yeah. That was insane. Oh, oh it's a catfish. Oh. Oh. <laughs> First catfish oh. of the day. Oh. What the heck? What is that? Hey. What is that? Oh my god, Dude, there's so many whiskers. There's so many like whiskers. What is this it thing? Like an alien, Paul. Oh my gosh. That's the craziest fish I think I've ever caught. Well, that's the Amazon. That's just the beginning. What? First species of the day is a whisker fish. I don't, why it I don't know like what it is. It's like a Medusa. Medusa. What the fuck? That's a cool fish. I thought I had a piranha. I guess not. Victor likes it. What are you doing there, Vic? <laughs> <laughs> See you, bud. Not a red tail, but it's something. Pharaohs, not really quite sure where we are. Oh, hey, little kitten. Oh, you are so cute. Look at how tiny. Hey, beautifuls. They're so cute. So they bring the village here, little kittens, to hunt the rats, the mice, and other predators that are out here. We initially thought the cats were in the box to get eaten because um, the English, there's no English here. So I was actually just talking to them about like what do we do with the kittens and they were like, I'm like, but no, they meant eat mice. Okay. Don't worry everyone, the kittens are being released onto the land as a gift for letting us come onto the land. They gift each other things here in the different separate villages. And they are absolutely adorable. Watch as you walk here, there's gigantic bullet ants. Well, looks like we're hopping on another boat, huh? I'm not quite sure what's going on, Um We initially thought we were going fishing, 
but we just pulled up to this village and we thought this village was just a five minute walk from the people on this trip that have already been. They said that. We are in these boats made out of a tree trunk though. This is a giant tree that they carved out. Looks like we're loading up on some goods. Are these the cats? Nope, that's not the cats. The cats are somewhere. We're in a canoe, we're going somewhere. There's a leak in the boat. There is a leak right there. Tell you what, views on views though. My goodness. Stop moving, this boat is too wobbly. I can't swim. Well fellas, we have arrived. Do I know where we arrived? Absolutely not. Centro Educa... Not even gonna give it a shot. You wonder how the heck they built that in the middle of this place. Along with all of that stuff, to be honest, you saw what we took here, that little canoe. How the heck? Yeah. I got a little man following me. <laughs> I think we're about to play some soccer, if I'm not mistaken. There's another soccer field. He just rang a bell. Oh, look at all the kids. Wow, there's a lot of kids here. <laughs> we got kids here, we got kids all around us. Hey guys. Dude, I'm about to go messy on these kids. <laughs> got the whole village out, ready to play. Hola. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 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 go, Paul, go! <laughs> they love it. <laughs> they love it. They're so happy. They're the happiest little people on the planet. That was awesome. <laughs> I've never been so excited with my life. This is the best day of my life. Uh, honestly, the best day of my life. I'm not gonna lie, this is amazing. That's crazy, out of the entire life we've lived, which has been crazy, uh, to say that this is that day, it is. It is. We just need a soccer ball. That's all we need. <laughs> oh, we got the football. Hey! Oh yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this kid's raw! He's good! I'm getting crossed by that. Oh! We're getting absolutely smoked. Smoked right now, bro. <laughs> Bunch of future athletes we're playing against right now. What is going on, crows? Welcome back to another video. <laughs> and that is Zach of Pharaohs. We have to leave, unfortunately. Big shout out to everyone here for allowing us to come in, play some soccer. It was a great time. Brenton, what do you think? This was the coolest experience the, of my the, life. The, the, the coolest far. experience of our entire lives. Like, happy, happy people. Dang, they're good at soccer. Let's just say that. Woo! 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 Ciao. 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 What an experience that was. Absolutely incredible. Like, life-changing type of experience. This GoPro look a little funny on my head. There's a big storm rolling in above us. Well, that's not gonna stop us from trying to catch this red tail. We're on a mission. I'm putting some more worms on my hook right now. I'm gonna cast out this new spot, see if we can catch something. Rest assured, that is not a good sign. There's a mountain there. You just can't see it because a load of rain is coming our way. This is gonna be so rough. The clip we're about to cut to, if it's not a red tail catfish, Unfortunately, it's gonna be this. I don't know. Oh my god! Well, boys and girls, fishing was fun while it lasted. Oh. <laughs> morning, Brenton. Well, good morning there, Big Papa Mama. How are you doing? Doing pretty swell. Oh. It's another day, fellas. We didn't catch yesterday, so. 
We're back at it. Today's another day. We're gonna catch something. No, we're gonna catch something. I don't know what we're going to catch. I know at one point we're going to catch a catfish. Big old... <clears throat> then we're gonna... I think before that we're gonna try and catch like the stuff that you guys see in the aquariums in the States, I think. But it's gonna be good. Thanks for doing my uh, second day intro. These are my broken cameras. Every camera I brought is broken. It's a good thing I got the iPhone. This has been my bed for the last couple of days, week. It's actually really comfortable. But uh, yeah, all right. My double check is successful. <laughs> Look how clear the water is. Oh my. Hopefully none of these are anacondas. Huh. Oh, wow. Wow. Well, that's a good way to start the morning, Caferos. I'm wearing my life jacket still. One of the coolest things about YouTube is we're able to come over here and share stuff like this with you guys watching. Who knows where you're watching from in the world, but you're getting to experience this right alongside me. That's crazy. We're walking through the jungle he's, as he's macheteing. Wow, look how clear that is. We are about 10 minutes into this jungle hike. Still going. No fish at this little hole here. I got a bite, but nothing crazy. And then he said, uh, vamanos, so going to the next one. We're probably about as deep as you could ever and I've ever been into a jungle. Look at this location. There's a waterfall. If I catch a fish, this will be the craziest fish I've ever had. Oh. <sighs> yeah. Come here, Paula. We did it. We did it, Brenton. Oh, <laughs> we have an hour walk back through the jungle now. I don't even know what we're getting into after this, but I'll pick up the camera wherever the heck we are. Boop, and just in the split of a second, we're thousands of miles away back home. First time I've been back in the fish building. Well, no, like I've, I've, I've been home, but first time you guys have seen it in a while. Let's check on Leo here. Hey, Leo, what's up up there, bud? You're getting big, you plant a I can never get this hibiscus to grow. I failed again miserably. Although, great, these are doing fantastic. He actually sleeps right here. Okay, enough of that. Um, yeah, over to the freshwater pond where everything is hand trained now. Arowana, largemouth bass, peacock bass. This arowana wants to literally eat my finger off. Look at him, so aggressive. And there's the one-eyed beast. Hey, and of course, the many other monsters that are down there. It's so weird, this water, it's impossible to get it clear, clear. It's not like the salt water, which I can keep crystal clear. This is really, really hard to get clear. It gets clear, but only to like a certain distance. After like about a foot away from the glass, it's like just kind of foggy. Today, I've got some news. If you watched the last video, we caught these massive pyara. <laughs> oh, <laughs> one of the hardest fighting freshwater fish on the planet. Those pyara, I've wanted to get for this pond, and surprisingly, they're legal in Florida. So we're actually allowed to bring them in. We're allowed to import them in and keep them as pets. Rodrigo has a couple big ones. I gave Rodrigo a ring, and I said, Rod, can I please have one? He said no. He said he's growing some of them out for his facility soon, but he will find me a big one. So I just wanted to let you guys know because I saw so many hundreds and hundreds of comments that I did indeed purchase a Pyara for the freshwater 5,500 gallon pond. It's gonna be about a foot long, but we're gonna have a Pyara in this pond. I don't have exact date for that. Obviously, I'll make a video. If you're subscribed with your notifications on, you'll see that video. But me and Rodrigo, we've confirmed I will have a Pyara inside this pond. I had to get it. That was one of the reasons why I wanted to go to the Amazon and catch that species to really like engage with it fully. It's literally the craziest fish ever, those teeth. There's a reason why it's called the vampire fish. And I wanted to let you guys know that for the 5,500 gallon, I did indeed purchase that. So, you know, we, we, we got a new fish. We didn't physically get it and put it in the pond yet. Yet. I'm so excited to be home. It was an amazing trip, a trip of a lifetime. But it is nice to be back and get back to my roots and get back to the pond stuff and the saltwater pond stuff and 
We've got some crazy stuff. We actually had to go get a bunch of tangs for the saltwater pond. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Big shout out to Factor for sponsoring today's video. All these companies that helped us make this entire trip possible. Worth every bit of the memories though. And you got to watch all of it right here. As a matter of fact, next video, I'm probably gonna post it tomorrow, but it's a full recap of the entire trip. All the videos just combined into one. And I wanna make that as like just a, a pretty much like a movie, a memory. So you'll see that video next. And then after that, it's back to the roots, baby. I'll see ya. Whenever the heck you see a notification for my channel. Love you guys. Peace.